police say the homeowner struggled with one of the suspects. And during the struggle, the homeowner shot the suspect who later died at a nearby hospital. Fox 10's Ste Stefania Coley just returned to the scene and joins us from the newsroom now. Stefania. Yeah, Matt and Linda, it was actually two men who stormed into this home just after 11 o'clock this morning. According to the Pinal County Sheriff's Office, one of them didn't make it out. As you mentioned, the homeowner shooting one of them, and at this hour, the other one is still on the run. I feel good for him. You know, he defended his home. Neighbors with nothing but praise for a man in their community who was the victim of a home invasion. I'm so glad that he is alive and well. Jennifer Holt says it's her dear friend who lives here, where deputies say two armed men stormed in. According to reports, the homeowner got into a scuffle with one of the men. He was able to pull a gun and shoot the suspect, who later died at the hospital. The other man taking off in what's described as a dark-colored car. People who run through the neighborhood and take from people who work very hard for their earnings. And hopefully, this will set an example to those um, destroying our neighborhood. Police say other witnesses were in the home at the time, but none were hurt. Jeez, yeah, I'm just so glad nobody else was hurt or involved. The Pinal, Pinal County Sheriff's Office, Matt and Linda, telling us that the homeowner did suffer some injuries and had to be treated, but he is going to be okay. Tonight, they weren't taking any additional questions about where they stand in the search and the investigation. However, we hope to have an update for you at 10. Reporting live from the newsroom, I'm Stefania Coley, this Fox morning, 10 an attempted News. robbery Hi, thwarted after the victim with a concealed carry permit shot the suspect. It happened yesterday in the parking lot of the Sitco gas station near 35th and Silver Spring. Police say the suspect tried to rob the man, and that's when the victim shot him. The suspect was taken to the hospital and is expected to survive.